All right, what's up, guys? Sniper Nick here, and I got my boy Al with me. Yo, what's up, snipers? Sniper Al in the house. Yep. All right, anyway, we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So today we're talking about SLS. It had a crazy day. Um, so jumping right into action here, as you can see, pre-market, it got a huge spike. So that's the reason why it came on our radar. It was on our biggest gainers. So it went up from three to, to five pre-market. So it came on our gainers list. As you could see, it did a spike, but it topped out around 675, and then it dipped. On this dip, it holds a 540 support, and as it holds a support, now we're starting to see it push back up. So I I think I was the only one watching it here, and um, I I think you were busy, right? Yeah, I was uh, busy in the morning. I was my first day back at work. I was on vacation, so. I was busy at work and I uh, couldn't really watch, unfortunately, because this is a nice one. Okay, <laughs> yeah. So, but. so, so, um, so I was I was watching this though, and um, there was a couple chances where I actually could have played this, um, but I never really pulled the trigger, unfortunately. Um, and as you can see here, um, well, let's see how it plays out. So, as you can see here, we're getting the first little dip here um, on this big on this push off that five five forty support. And I'm watching it here, and as you can see, I called out to the snipers there. I said, I think I'm starting to like this here. So I'm watching it to see how, how, how uh, what it's going to do. The support is good there. I mean, and that's actually, that spot's the breakout spot. I mean, the, the yeah, the breakout spot pre-market. Mm -hmm. That's a high hit pre-market, which ended up being the support. It broke that pre-market and then turned to being support yeah, that's during a good market point. hours. So that's that was a, good a really point. good level there to that's risk off point. of. Yeah. So, so also you see now, um, I, I, set, I, I, I get my limit ready. I have my finger on the trigger here when I saw that nice little volume push. So you see that it held that 540 perfectly, and then it gets a little volume perk here, and it breaks that 590 uh, resistance. When it broke that 590 resistance, uh, I had my finger on the trigger there, and I was going to use 590 as my cut, but I did want to see it play out a little bit more. And as you can see, it ended up pushing a, a little bit more. So I missed my move. But what's so awesome and what's so amazing about this penny stock world, guys, is if you miss the first initial move, it is okay. It's not over. This, pl oh. yeah. So th this this recording, we end up making money on the tail end of this move later on in the day. But but ch let's let's go ahead and check out this initial move, which was a crazy move that so much people made a whole bunch of money off of. Yeah. Um, so check this out. So jumping into it, here's the breakout. So ten fifteen. We get that nice little volume perk, and it pushes past that high it made in the morning. And then check this out. Fast forward a little bit more, and we get a push even more. And it gets halted. So look at that move right there. And um, keep in mind, guys, this is a, a low flow play. Low flow plays are hot in the penny stock world. If you guys are new to this, just I want that word just to linger for a little bit. Low flow plays. People go crazy over it for some reason in the penny stock world. Um, well, we'll explain that more in our training DVD, but we'll have to you have to wait for that. Um, but anyway, jumping back into it, like look at this move. It's crazy. Um, where where do you see this? It's 10:40, right? So 10:40. We're an hour and 10 minutes into the day. An hour and 10 minutes from the market open, from a business opening, and you have already a hundred. Your money has already gone up 180%. You have potential to do that. Now, we're not even taking the full move. That's not what we preach. We preach the meat of the move. Even taking any meat of that move, you could have made a great gain. Um, but, e but anyway, even if you missed it, jumping in and fast-forwarding it, check this out. So we let it so fast-forward all the way up to 340. We let it play out, and we let it create a support. And you saw that this stock moves a lot on the day. Um, so it stayed on our radar throughout the day, and at 340, it's holding 140% gains. And now we're actually looking. You saw that it held 840 support. It dipped, and it started to make. Uh, it bounced off VWAP, started to make a higher low. And now we're looking to get in. As you can see, I have my limit ready, but uh, Al's back in action. And Al actually, I think he jumped. Yeah. He, he got. He got it. I here was without back me. in action, and I mean, we've actually been trying to get in the same stock at the same time all the time, and <laughs> this is just another one of those times where we're Boom. like like minds think alike. And uh, I mean, it's really I really love the do double bottom at eight bucks that it made there, and it happened to be mm -hmm. VWAP as well. So, and it I mean, it's holding 150 percent gains on the day, which is really impressive. Mm -hmm. It's a low float. It's bouncing off the the double bottom support. Mm -hmm. It's already 3:45 p.m. It's got good news with it. Mm -hmm. It's you know, everything you need for a what, recipe for a high a day push. What would you What would you risk here? The risk was only 
I was only risking like 20 cents maximum here. Yeah, like so that I, 840 support. Yeah, I wasn't. If this was going to start coming coming back down to that eight support, I'm I, I'm going to get rid of it. There's only 15 minutes left, so there's only not much time to, to for it to do what it needs to do. So. Um, yep. So 20, 20, 20 cent risk to the downside, and then I I had my vision was that it would go to ten bucks. So mm-hmm. that's I was looking for a dollar sixty upside. Mm-hmm. I mean a dollar forty upside and twenty twenty cent downside. Yeah. So I thought it was worth the risk. And and, that, and and that's all we play. And that's that's what this game's all about. The risk reward. All right. We're huge on risk management. Yep. And 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 right there. I mean this this is key right here. You you check out that risk reward, and, and we'll sh- you know. We're all here to help you guys find these plays, um, but you know this is a play where the risk reward is set up, so we're giving it a go. So let's see how it plays out. So we're letting it play out. Um, you know, it's 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 actually holding some buyers holding coming in there pretty nicely, and we got some buyers. Yeah, look at this, and it's, it's eight forty eight. Makes a push to nine bucks. Yep. So that's promising. There's a little resistance there at nine. So, you know, I was looking to see how it react to nine. Um, but there wasn't a ton of volume here at the end of the day. There was some good volume coming in, but it, you know, the ask was and bid were spread a little bit. I don't yeah. know. It was it, it, you know, it looks here it likes it could make a good push. The ask went all the way up to nine twenty here mm-hmm. with twelve minutes left. This could rip to ten here. It yeah. looks like, you know, yeah. coming off at eight, pretty strong. Mm-hmm. Coming off that double bottom at eight looks pretty strong here. But mm-hmm. it's already you know three fifty. Yeah, um, and as you can tell, I even said, "Hey, listen, I'm down to take the quick move." We were up, yeah. we hunt uh, 250 bucks quick. Yep. Mm-hmm. I was cool with taking it, but I, I like this play. Look at you heard Al's uh, um, thesis of this. He was letting this play out a little bit. Like, there's no harm in that. He he his theory his thesis was that it was gonna it it could squeeze and check this out. No harm done. It 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 it, it takes a little dip, but. The dip never cracks. I was prepared. I was prepared when it was dipping like that to to cut if it did get slippery there. If it did get slippery at the end of the day, I was my finger was on the trigger ready to go. So yeah, um, I I was gonna make sure there was no nothing no harm done with this trade here at all. So yeah, and that's um, a good point because now now it's three fifty five, so it's not making as big of a push as we thought it was gonna make. It's three fifty six now. Um, we our goal we, we weren't gonna take this overnight. Um, we thought it was a little bit risky to take overnight. Yeah. You know, it's up one hundred sixty percent. You see the long term chart; it's horrible, like most of these penny stocks. Yep, exactly. Um, there is some resistance at that key ten level on the daily as well. Mm-hmm. So this is kind of mid range right now in the range between eight and eight and ten dollars here. So yeah, but it's holding that range. Yeah. So a break either way is uh, what we're looking for probably tomorrow. Yeah. And it was too risky to hold overnight, but if it does hold and, and, and start to perk up towards 10 tomorrow, I think we will be looking at it. Yeah. But that'll be on our watch list for so all our subscribers out. in our chat room. So check this out. Bam. And there it is. And there's the sell. It was as simple as that. Uh, 861 to looks like 896 in the matter of 16, 17 minutes. Um, and, here, and here's the chart to finish it off. So just to show you guys, you know, even if you missed that initial spike, there is still opportunity all right, there's no reason to freak out about it. Keep it on the radar if it gets if it becomes a big enough spiker and capitalize when you feel the most comfortable. In the morning as you guys yep. can see, we were on we were unsure. You guys heard in our voices. So, we didn't play it. We stepped away. We let it run. It's all right. We ended up playing it on the end of the day and, and taking a nice little 200 bucks in 7 minutes. Or 17 minutes, sorry. So, what a crazy gain. Um or what a, I mean, what a just a crazy, crazy day while the mark was red. But anyway, check us out on Facebook, guys, or check us out on Instagram. Here's our Instagram. Our, our feed is at Stock Snipers. Um, we're posting pics and stories up there all the time. Also, you can always check us out on Twitter. Um, we're on there throughout the trading day, so you can always go on there from uh, even outside of the trading day. You can reach out to us. You can also always DM us if you want to reach out to us directly. Um, and then lastly, check us out on Facebook. Um, we'll be posting our um, a, a brief watch list on there every morning until we get our site fully up and running. So make sure you check us out there. Um, but anyway, thanks for tuning in, guys. I hope everyone has an amazing rest of the week. Um, just wanted to bring this video to show you guys that there is opportunity in this crazy. I wanted to show you this amazing, amazing opportunity of the penny stock world. Yep. I mean, check this out. Everybody's freaking out about the Dow today, and you got... We're not we're not sweating over here. You yep. got a stock here, SLS, that went up 180 yep. percent, while everyone else was freaking out and the market's red. You guys could have done even better than we did. We we caught we caught a small move at the end of the day. This was a, a big gain in the morning. So 
that's what and that's what we're we're here for. We're we're here for you guys to make these gains, even even if we don't hit them. You know, we're we're here to sh- point them out, show you that this is possible. Yeah, definitely. So. Exactly, exactly. Because this 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 market was hidden and. After we've been exposed, it's 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 amazing. So the more people and more eyes on it, the better. Exactly. So let's do this. Let's get rich together, guys. Um, thanks for tuning in. Uh, like this video, comment on it. We'll answer. Let us know whatever any questions, and um, of course, check subscribe to the YouTube channel, man. We'll be posting more. All right, everyone, have a great rest of your week, and we'll see you later. All right, snipers. See ya. See ya.